my name is Robbie Rogers and I, I go to Pfeiffer University, which is in um, Meisenheimer, uh, right outside of um, Charlotte in, in a little town, Salisbury area. So um, the summer of 2012, which is this past summer, I worked for Windship Camps for Communities. Um, it was my first year working there. Um, it was a great experience. Um, some of the things we did during the summer was um, that I did was that I was a uh, I was part of the safari group and I, I, I was the, I, I led the cheetahs in um, Bible study. One thing I realized about this summer is that God, 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 God gave everybody a story. If good or bad, He gave us stories in our life. But it is not, it is not, um, it, it is not our story for us to keep. It's not for us to keep. So that He gives us, he, he gave us those stories so that we can go out and reach other people and bring other people closer to God. Like for, for instance, in, um, it was the fourth week in Thomasville, Georgia. Um, uh, after ch and leading my small group Bible study, um, we, we were leaving the classroom and then I looked back and I saw this uh, one of my campers just sitting in the corner praying. And then I went back to him and I, was, I asked him, I said, what's going on buddy? Uh, why are you, what are you sitting here doing? He told me he was praying and I said, what are you praying for? He told me that, he told me that a couple of months ago, um, that his dad um, murdered his mom right in, right in front of him. So that um, the the reason why that that, that kind of brought that memories is, is it was that um, I just told my story of, of of how I grew up in West Africa and that I'm an orphan and how um, even though it's been hard, but God has used that story to bring other people to God. And then right then it kind of evoked an emotion in him and he started thinking about, about his mom. So he was, he was sad, so he was praying for his mom. So right then I knelt down to him and we started talking. He told me his story. And then um, I told him my story too and I, I was there as an emotional support for him and as a role model throughout the week and just to encourage him and to whenever he's feeling down, whenever um, he doesn't want to do anything, I'm, I'm, I'm the one he usually comes to, he, he comes to and we, we, I, I try to um, encourage him and uplift him through um, different games and also encourage him to, to spend some time reading the Bible. And I, I just thought that was incredible um, how God can use my story. It is not my story to keep. Um, it is God's story and as she, she used his story to bring other people to God.